I mean, Badger football, man, it's just it's just playing that hard-nosed football, man. Um, I, I think um, our defensive mindset this year, you know what I'm saying, that kind of like just the history of Badger football, like put the, put the ball down, man. I mean, guys are going to um, rain, sleet, or snow, you know what I'm saying. Guys are going to come in and play their butts off, you know what I'm saying. We don't have the most athletic. We don't have the, um, the fastest players. Um, well, we don't have – we don't even have the smartest players, but you're not going to outwork us for 60 minutes. And so I really think that that – that sounds off on what Badger football is, man. Guys coming in, working every day, you know what I'm saying? It's kind of like the, the, the construction worker. Every day, he's going to have his lunchbox with him. He's going to bring his hard hat. He's going to go to work. And that's Badger football, man. We're going to go to work every single game and every single day. I mean, I think you're right. right, I, th right, right, right. I, th I think we have a perception that we're, we're not very right. – we are a good football player. Right. I mean, we have good athletes. Does that work to your advantage? I, I don't I mean, people I don't, maybe take you for granted as athletes. I, don't, I think people respect us. I think they're right. starting to respect yeah, I us. Think, yeah. I really think Aaron hit it on the head. Um, you know, we're a, we're a working institution. Um, you know, we, we do have good athletes. We do have good football players. We do have smart football players. Are we the best in all those categories? Probably not. But, you know, we, we, we play well as a team together and we get the job done. We win games. And that's, um, you know, that's, that's the Wisconsin mindset, you know, come in. Every day, ready to work, ready to grind. You know, play as a team, play together, and you know we'll have success. I think the thing is, though, I think we're football players. Yeah. I think a lot of schools have athletes. I think yep. I think we know how to play football. What's the difference? Well, I think with an athlete, I mean, you got you got these combine guys who run fast and yeah. jump and high, jump high, and they're freakishly athletic. I think, even though we may not be the most athletic players, I think we know how to play the game and we know how to line up and play football. Because honestly, you can run all summer and you can lift weights and be strong, but when it comes down to it, you do all that to apply it on the football field. And that's what think, it's about. Think, think about, I mean, and, and there's always exceptions to the rules, but you think about the best football players. Do the best football players in college and the pros run the fastest 40, you know, have the highest vertical, you know, are, are, are they the, the most freakishly athletic? Most of the time, they're not. Some, some, some of the best players are. Yeah, but and those are the ones know, that truly stand yeah, out. And, 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 those, and a lot of times, not only are they outstanding athletes, but they're also football players. Right. So are we talking about Wisconsin football? It's about structure, it's about fundamentals, it's about techniques. It's about playing football. football. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I mean, football. great example. Um, maybe we can throw great examples out there. I mean, we have just this Wisconsin's like walk on university. You know what I'm saying? We have a lot of guys, we don't have no five star recruits coming here. A lot of walk ons come there, earn scholarships, go to the NFL. Jimmy look, Leonard. Look at a guy like Jimmy Leonard, Leonard right. Luke Swan, JJ Watt, Chris Maris, Jared Abadaris. Marigos, uh, Chris yeah. Maragos. Yeah. Um, you know, we, we, the list goes on. And well, this program does a good job of developing right, those right, types. Right, yeah, right, right, exactly. Absolutely. Maximizing the potential. Yes. But, but the whole point in saying that is, you know, we, we bring in football players. And you don't have to be the best in every category to be a great football player. You're willing to work. If you're willing to work, you know what I'm saying, you're willing to bring your hard hat to work every single day, you can get some out of it. Jim Leonard is 5'7", five, 5'8", five, on a great day. You know what I'm saying? Jim Leonard, when I first saw him, I thought he was one of the janitors, one of the guys, the ball boys. But Jim Leonard is an amazing athlete, an amazing football player, I should say. There seems to be a stereotype about Wisconsin football. Is that fair to say? Oh, yeah. Nationally, more oh, yeah. so than oh, yeah. regionally. Oh, yeah. Definitely. Most definitely. But the, the way you play? Right. We're only going to yeah. run the ball and, and this and that. and You only have um, your players are not that fast. You know, I mean, the same stereotype it was going into a Miami game. You know, Miami is going to run all over us. You know what I'm saying? This and that showed the 30 for 30, great segment. Miami's going to win the game. You know what I'm saying? If the game was played off the field, we would have we would have lost all our games. You know what I'm saying? If it was played off the field. But thank God it's played between the lines. Well, maybe you've been able to sneak up on some people in the past. Right. Do you think that's going to be the case anymore? I don't think so. I think you start to look at the national landscape. And I think that what we did last year, I think we realized we're pretty good. I mean, yeah. we have a good football team when we play well. And, if we and can, I, I do I do think that, um, you know, coming into this season, I think that we are pretty well respected. And, um I think people do know, you know, what we're capable of. So, but I think the one thing that we have to our advantage, and I think last year was the best example we could have had. I think we prepared so well during the week, yes. but we practiced so well during camp, and that's when you make your team. Took nothing for granted, did yes. you? Never. Exactly. Didn't waste a single day. Maximize. I think. I think honestly, the, when I look back, the game we lost against Michigan State. That Thursday practice was, was, the our worst. Worst, was our worst practice was of the, the year. Worst, hands by far. Yep. Horrible All season. Yep. Yeah. All season. Mm -hmm. It was bad. Yeah. yeah. After that, that was kind of like a wake-up call. And after that, we started rolling. We started practicing well. And it sounds so cliche, but we really took advantage of our practices to get us ready for the game. And that's, I think that's why on Saturday we come out rolling fast.